I'm Allison Stone. I work for Columbia University on the MOTAC project that's mobile technology for community health in northern Ghana. And one of the things that we ran into in the MOTEC project, um, we designed it so that women can receive, so pregnant women can receive messages that are voice messages, so not text messages, so they don't have to be literate. And also the messages are in the local languages, so they don't have to understand English. So we're focusing on um, very rural, poor areas. So we thought, well, you know, voice messages in local languages. Um, now about 20% of women have their own phones in this area. But another, like, 60% have access to a phone either through their spouse or through their household or through another member of the community. So we designed MoTeC in a way that women can borrow someone else's phone to access uh, their, their messages, um, and it won't cost anything. So we thought we had all our bases covered. You know, they don't have to have a phone, they don't have to speak English, they don't have to be able to read, right? Well, we ran into issues of um, phone literacy, where women who don't own their own personal phone don't know how to use a phone at all. So, like, we had a woman who said, you know, the phone is telling me to press 1 to hear my message in non-Kani, but what is 1? So, it was like, well, yeah, we, we thought we had designed everything to, to really have access for these women, but actually, they don't know how to use a phone, so we need to have, like, just general training sessions on how to use phones we want the project to work um, in that kind of a population. So that was something we did not anticipate.